Alright, so this is it. Last part, part three of the TMI challenge. Um, if you've seen part one and part two, you get it. You know what's happening. But to reiterate, um, it's just a way for you, like, for viewers to get to know their YouTubers. See maybe something you do or don't have in common, you know. Um, how long does it take you to shower? one of those that doesn't stay in the shower and most of the time I would prefer a bath but um when I get a shower it's I wash my hair wash and get out no longer than 10 minutes no longer than 10 minutes uh that's one of the places I don't like I don't want to be in there any longer than necessary um how long does it take you to get ready in the morning um morning fluctuates for me um However, when I get ready to go somewhere, I, I'm not really that high maintenance. Um, so, I mean, y'all can tell. I don't do like some YouTube chicks and do all the crazy hair. Um, none of that. Um, so it don't take me about 20 minutes to get ready um, when I go to get go somewhere. I'm very low maintenance. Like, I, I like simple, I guess. Um... If y'all can't tell in my videos, my makeup's never done crazy. It's pretty almost, pretty much always basic, so it doesn't take me that long. Um, have you ever been in a physical fight? Yes. I don't want to elaborate, but yes. Um, I turn on. What? <laughs> um, it's kind of weird, I guess. Kind of weird. I like a guy that smells good. That's for sure one of them. But, like, you know, the the guy that smells good, not overbearing, but good. Um, or a guy with good taste in shoes. Um, that goes to the next question. Turn off a dude with ugly shoes. I don't care if you're cute or not. If you got ugly shoes, I don't care. I don't care. Like, that's, that's always been a weird thing of mine. Like, I will check dude's shoes before asking where he works or what his favorite color is or you know what I mean it's it's a little superficial I'm aware but everybody's got their like weird thing that's mine um the reason I joined YouTube had to ask a loaded question didn't you honestly it was more to like share my opinion um I wanted, in a way, to downplay people's perception of Southerners. I don't understand. I get it a little bit, but I don't fully understand why it's still a thing like the rest of the country or the, you know, other countries think that the Southern states are still ill-educated or uninformed, and it, it bugs me a little bit. So, um, I started my channel to maybe enlighten people that are not all southerners or backwoods hillbilly hey y'all we're not all like that we're, there are some but <laughs> we're not all like that um so it was to share my opinions and um engage with other people like my favorite part of youtube is being being seen or viewed in other countries getting to interact with people from other countries um, I find that really fascinating. These people were people I'd never gotten to talk to, never gotten to engage with, um, had it not been for YouTube. So, uh, the interaction, the sharing opinions, and the changing perception. That's, that's why I started doing YouTube. Um, fears. Okay, everybody's got a, a ton of fears or things that like, I don't want a part of that, you know, I'm not a fan of spiders, I'm not a fan of snakes, I'm not a fan of creepy crawly creature thingies, but, um, I can deal with them, I can, I can kill a snake, or I can squish a spider, you know, my, my only fear that, like, actually sends me into, like, freak out, shut down, I'm mortified mode, is clowns, I never been to a circus, um, can't watch anything with a clown. Can't deal with a clown. Honestly, I would probably rather go skydiving 
than to meet a clown. I don't, if I, have, if I meet a clown, I instantly feel threatened and I'm going to go defensive. It's probably dangerous for the clown to encounter me. Um, other than that, I don't have anything that's a severe threat, I guess. Um, I, have a feel, I have a fear of failure. I mean, I think every person should have that. But clowns, fear of failure. But that's it. Um, not leaving a mark on the world. You know, something impressionable. Um, but that's really it. There's no, like, I guess nothing too out the box. Or too cliche either. Um, last thing that made you cry. Y'all are going to think I'm a turkey when I say this. Um, it was actually a song. I was showing, um, Mark Wills, Don't Laugh at Me. That song makes me cry every time I ever hear it. Um, I think it's like the only one that will always get a reaction. So, two days ago... I was showing that song, and, well, in the first verse, I was in tears. Mark Wills, don't laugh at me. Here's what I want to do. I want to issue a little slight challenge. I want, if you see this video, watched it this far, you to go, after you, after you click subscribe and like and commented, I want you to go listen to that song, Mark Wills, don't laugh at me. I want you to go listen to that song and come back, drop a line in the comment section. See, let me know if it's just me that this song just puts in tears. Um, meaning behind your YouTube name. Well, my channel is just, just Jessica. So, <laughs> I don't know that that's any more obvious. My email is um, Blue Eyes. So, there's really not a meaning behind it. I hate to be that person, <laughs> you know, evading a question, but there's really not. I mean, there's, there's no funny story, nothing like that. Um, last book I read, probably the Supernatural book, I do believe that's it. Um, they, uh, uh, Barnes and Noble? Or books a million. I can't remember where I got these. Y'all know I'm a fan of the show, but I freaked out when I found out they had books. So, uh, yeah. That's the last ones I bought. I started reading them. I don't remember if I finished reading them because, hell, who remembers shit like that? Excuse my language. Um, that's the end of these. Uh, I think it was a pretty interesting challenge, honestly. Uh... It got me to thinking about some stuff I wasn't really thinking about. But I do think that they need to cut the questions in half. Because the videos would go long unless you're just like, I'm wearing this. I've did that. I've, this is my favorite band. This, you know, unless you got the answers just ready to pop off and no explanation or, you know, no engaging. Just, I think the list needs to be downsized. But, I guess you could choose what you do and don't want to answer, but that's not really getting to know your YouTuber. So, anyway, we finished the list. 30 questions. Um, you've seen some of these questions. Let me know your answers. What, what are you wearing? What is, have you ever been in love? Uh, what are some of your fears? Or, how tall are you? Do you feel taller than, you know, um... Let me know. I want to know about you now. Hell, y'all get to y'all get to know a little about me. I want to know about y'all. Um, so like, comment, subscribe down below. Um, you get a chance. I got uh several other videos to check out as well. Um, if they if you just seen part three, go watch part one and part two. Um, there are more questions. This crazy thing. I think YouTube should have hashed this down. Like I said, but um, till next time. That's it. TMI challenge for YouTube is complete. Hope you feel like you know a little more about me. Yes, I am freakishly tall. <laughs> um, for a chick.
not as tall as my sister, so I'm still okay with this, but, um, I hope you learned a little bit about me, um, leave some comments about you, let me know something about you, answer these questions for me in the comments, I want to know, um, until next time, I will see you guys later, y'all have a great night.